What's going on guys, King Tar Heel here, and uh, today we're going to do uh, some Teeth of Naros info. This is the upcoming DLC for Kingdoms of Amalur Reckoning, the second DLC. Uh, it's coming out on April 17th, you can get it on all platforms, PSN, Xbox Live, Origin, Steam, uh, and it's going to be $9.99. And uh, they introduced the FAQ for it, so I thought I would just go through and summarize what I thought were the interesting points of the FAQ, get you guys ready for it. Um, promotional note, I am going to be off uh, on April 17th for this, so I'll go ahead and do a... Uh, full video and full coverage of it. Uh, try to get a review done if I can and uh, provide it on how long it is uh, so you guys can expect that. The same with the Legend of Dead Kel that I did. So first things first, uh, no new level cap. Uh, they wanted to do what they said but logistically they just couldn't get it done. Uh, so there is no new level cap but they know that it's something that's been asked for so hopefully uh, we'll get it coming really soon. But they are adding some really new cool features. So the first thing I want to discuss is they have a new primal damage or a new type of damage. And what this is, you'll get primal weapons, and you'll be able to do uh, increased damage for a short period of time. Uh, the developer says that there's 20 hours of gameplay on this DLC. Uh, I don't know if that's including all the side quests and, and everything that's going along with it. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, but I'm assuming that the main quest isn't going to be 20 hours, uh, but that would be awesome if it was. Um, next point is you are able to fast travel in this DLC unlike the Legend of Dead Kel so you can go to it and seamlessly go back and forth uh, that was an issue that was brought up by some comments on my Legend of Dead Kel review uh, that was an issue for a lot of people uh, we have a new enemy which is like a giant bipedal bird uh, they kind of compared it to a Toucan Sam uh, that uses storm magic and heavy melee magic excuse me uh, we have a new race uh, called the Colossae, uh, I think that's how you say it, uh, and it's a new race of giants uh, that I'm actually pretty excited about. If you haven't seen the trailer, I uh, recommend checking out the trailer. Um, so they're actually friendly, um, civilized giants, so I'm actually kind of excited uh, to see them. Um, Naros, uh, the actual, you know, the Teeth of Naros is a troll god. Uh, that's all they would elaborate on it, so it's a troll god. And there is no level requirement for this upcoming DLC. Uh, you can go from the Well of Soul to the Teeth of Naros. Uh, it's, you know, straight up the box, no level 10, uh, unlike the Legend of Dead Kelp. So that's the info I have for you guys, man. I hope you enjoy um, and are excited about uh, the Teeth of Naros. It looks pretty cool. So, again, I'll have full coverage on Tuesday, April 17th. And that's it, guys. Have a good night. Take care. Bye.